Hi, everybody. I know that this is not <laughs> an ideal way to watch a video, but unfortunately, there's no way to download a chat tile from Marco Polo. And I really felt that this message was something I wanted to share outside of our Marco Polo group um, and hope that I can do an archaic way of, of recording that video for you guys. Good morning, everybody. So you're on a tripod. What does that mean? <laughs> that means that Edie has a lot to say. <laughs> I don't feel like holding the phone. Um, I wanted to kind of pop in here really quick and utilize a platform that I think is really advantageous to not only you as consultants, but as individuals, maybe for your customers, your teams, there's so many uses for Marco Polo that I think it's awesome. I love seeing little um, chat heads popping down as you guys are joining me. Um, but I want to make sure that we're not getting caught up in some spiral of nothingness. What does that mean, Edie? What does that mean? What do you mean nothingness? Um, it is so possible. Okay, so, so this platform has become an amazing way for us to share ideas, for us to lift each other up, for us to ask questions and get answers. It has been truly amazing for that. Don't you agree? I think you, you would agree. And... The only thing that I could see happening, and I'm, I'm almost thinking that it is happening a little bit. I don't know for sure, but let's, let's be honest with ourselves, okay? Let's be honest with ourselves and say, all right, I go and I visit Marco Polo five, six hundred times a day. <laughs> um, and I'm asking questions and I'm seeing these amazing ideas. What am I doing with it? What am I doing with these ideas? What am I doing with the knowledge that I'm gaining from all these amazing consultants? What am I doing with it? Is it just going off into nothingness? Or am I actually applying it into my business? Is it something that I am incorporating into my business that is becoming useful for me? Am I passing the information on to somebody else in, our, in my team, maybe. I want to make sure that you are not utilizing this platform to suffice your fears. It is one thing for us to talk about stuff, right? But it's another to actually put things into action. Um, I don't know if some of you may have seen the video that I did recently um, in regards to thought plus emotion plus action equal results. And the thing is that I feel sometimes that there may be a lot of thought, there may be a lot of emotion, there may be a lot of that happening in here, and then we're allowing this platform to be our action, and it's not. It's not. Yeah, it took action for you to ask the question. Yes, you may have um, overcome a fear by coming on here and asking the question or being on video, right? That's a huge fear. So a lot of that um, can be looked at as, yes, I'm overcoming some fears by coming on Marco Polo. That's going to help you emotionally and through your thought process, but it's not going to hold your hand to go out and make the samples. It's not going to hold your hand while you go and have these conversations with customers, okay? Don't let Marco Polo be your crutch, okay? Lucy's having a fit outside. She barks at the wind. She literally is barking at the wind. It's crazy. It was her birthday yesterday. She was a year old. Um... So please don't use Marco Polo to be your crutch to help suffice the fear that you have in creating action in your business, okay? I hope that makes sense to all of you. And if it doesn't, let's have a discussion about it. Here's a great place to do that. Um, I don't, 
I just don't want you guys to get hung up in not being able to see all the videos, in thinking that asking a question is all the action that you need to do in your business, because it's not. Um, you know, posting a question on our group page on Facebook is action to your fear, but it will not eliminate fear of moving forward with whatever it is that you asked. I hope that makes sense, and then I'm not rambling. Um, but it kind of hit me this morning. I thought, you know, there's a lot of a lot of conversation around sampling, around this, around that, and that's great. I think that's amazing. But I want you to be honest with you and say, am I taking the information that I am getting from Marco Polo and applying it into my business and taking action on the things that I'm learning. I share a quick story with you. When I was um, first starting out with Sensi, um, I had told myself that I wanted to get as much information as possible. I was asking questions. I was reading. I was watching videos. I was studying. I was doing everything that I needed to do, learning about training my brain and creating action in my in my business and learning about putting forth processes and procedures that would help me in my business. I learned till I was blue in the face. Learning, 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 learning is amazing if you put it into action. So I remember having a moment um, sitting here at my desk thinking, good Lord, Edie, how much more can you learn? How much more can you learn? You need to put this shit into action. You need to apply this into your business and do the things that you've learned. I don't want you guys to get stuck in that vortex of learning um, because we use that, we use learning as a crutch to the fear of action. And it kind of goes in the same breath as someone who just started Sensi and they say, I need to learn all of this. I need to understand. I need to know the product. I need to know the compensation plan. I need to know how I get paid, when I get paid, how it is to be a leader, but you've got nobody underneath you and you're learning and you're learning and you're learning and you're learning and nothing is happening in your business. You're not recruiting anybody because you're too afraid to take all of this knowledge that you learned and move forward with it and create action in your business, okay? So I hope this was a good message for you guys today. If it was something that you internalized being you, great. If you're not internalizing it being you, then share the message with somebody else. Take that action, okay? Have a great day, everybody.